if your costs are that high to keep the network operating at that point, um, if your price is going to be a hundred dollars a month for decent fiber, then uh, the idea being that uh, $30 discount isn't going to do a whole lot for, for low income families. So I think that's the thinking. And uh, per usual, the implementation is the challenge. Um, so, and as Rai reminds me on the ACP dashboard.com, every two weeks, our colleagues, uh, Christine, our colleague Christine in this case updates it. And uh, right now we're forecasting there's less than 10 months of money left. And that is at the current rate of drawdown. Okay. Well, I have to agree with Peggy who popped up a comment here. I, I just don't see the tie in between the ACP rate. I mean, if, you, if they want to give subsidy to these areas, this is a back door way to do it. So. Well, I, that's what I don't understand, Doug, right? Why don't they just give it directly? If they're going, are, are they still? Well, again, the, this was, Congress did this. This was written in law. So that, right, this is explicitly not a portable subsidy program, right? Yeah, a portable yes. subsidy program gives a discount, gives a voucher to a person, and that person chooses who to give it to. This is a weird combination of different approaches that um, seems unwieldy. So well, somebody, yes, somebody right. snuck this in the federal language. It's, it's a mystery. Yeah, because it's like, can rural telcos raise their price to get that 75 subsidy? What if they only had a $65 price point and are they going to raise it up to 90 they are. to get the entire 75? So it's, yeah, yes, it will. just doesn't seem that it to, would work. To, to answer that question, in LA, uh, before ACP, AT&T had a $10 product because they could get the $9.95 uh, from, the, from the lifeline. And as soon as ACP was passed, they raised their price to thirty dollars. So the answer is yes, they will raise the price to at least at least seventy five dollars. But I don't know if AC, I don't know if AT and T will qualify in any of these areas. And and I and I do think that the rural telcos may have different well, it answers approaches. The, it answers the question of whether they raise the rate to get some will. subsidy. Yes. Yeah, like so. some some companies are 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 trying to drink as much milk uh, from uh, the government teat as possible. Absolutely. Mm -hmm.